Today is Tuesday, April 6th, 2021. This is part four of a four-part series where we're looking at the ukemi. We took a look at the Ushido ukemi, mayukemi, keiko. We took a look at Ushido ukemi. We took a look at mayukemi. Now we're going to take a look at mayukemi keiko. This is an exercise that, uh, that you can do that's really, really good for developing the front roll, also developing the hip movements, turning the hips, developing strength in the legs, getting up right away, and also for cardiovascular power. This is pretty tiring and you can get very dizzy doing this. For this exercise, I do need to take off my microphone. So I'll be taking off the mic and you'll be hearing me from the camera microphone. Okay guys, so with my Ukemi Keiko, you're gonna start off in Kamai just the exact same way we did the front roll in the previous, previous video. I think it's two videos ago. Um, it was one video ago. No, it was two videos ago. Two yeah, videos. Right, yeah. Start off in Kamai fighting stance, churn your hips. You're gonna go into that roll. You're gonna come up, step forward. Am I in the shot? Yes. Okay. Step forward, you're gonna turn your hips around. Okay, then you're gonna step forward again, going into the next roll. Okay, then I come up, I step forward again, I turn my hips, I step forward again, and I go into Hidari no Kamai with my left arm rolling. And I come up, step forward with my right foot, turn around, Step forward with my right foot, Migi no Kamai, front roll. And again, step, turn, step, roll. So this is a way to do the Mayu Kemi Keiko. Um, it, for beginners, I'm doing it kind of slow, taking those steps. But then, as you progress and as you get a really, really good feel for this, you can actually come up much faster, turning much faster, rolling much faster. So the whole idea is to go back and forth very quickly. So let me see if I can do that for you today. Okay, go from here, quickly. Okay, so. Let me take a break. That's that really gets you, gets your juices going, gets your heart rate up, and it makes you a little dizzy. But it's a great exercise to do practicing your rolls in a way that's going to help you improve your technique in Aikido. I hope this video helps you get better at Aikido. Please remember to hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, hit that thumbs up button, and I'll see you in the next video.